Hello, in this tutorial, you're going to learn how to solve this beautiful equation. Let's do that together. So we begin with our solution. So this is what we have, 7 to the power of x multiplied by 7 to the power of x is 70. Now, just quickly, a reminder, a to the power of m multiplied by this is a to the power of m add n. Multiplication turns to addition of powers. So apply it here. So we have 7 to the power of x at x. So we have this is equal to 70. What do you do? Simplify. Add this, it gives you 2x is equal to 70. Also remember, for every a to the power of m raised to power n, is a to the power of m multiplied by n, which is a to the power of n raised to power m. So let's apply it here. So we are going to have, this is the same as 7 squared raised to power of x. And if you multiply this, it gives you back 2x. And this is equal to 70. Now we keep solving. If you are a returning viewer, thank you for choosing to learn trials. If you are still new, hit that subscription button. And if you find this interesting, don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Thank you. And let's keep solving to have. So this is the same as, you know, that 7 squared is 49. So we have 49 to the power of x is equal to 70. Now at this point, can we express 70 in powers of 49? It's not possible. So just quickly take log of both sides. So we have log of 49 to the power of x is equal to log of 70. Now what do you do now? Just remember that for every log of a raised to power x, the power multiplies, we have x log a. So apply it here. We are having x log 49 is equal to log of 70. What do you do next? Our target is on x. So we are going to remove this. To do that, divide. So you divide both sides by log of 49. So this takes off this. We are going to have x is equal to log of 70 divided by log of 49. Do you intend to leave it like this? No, it's not simplified yet. So we are going to simplify it. You know too well that 70 is the same as 7 multiplies by 10. And 49, as you have seen earlier, is the same as 7 squared. Did you see? So we can write it as 7 squared. So let's apply this here to how x is equal to log of 70. We have 7 multiplied by 10 and is divided by log of 49 is this. So we have 7 squared. Now what do you do next? Remember, for every log of a multiplied by b, it's always log of a plus log of b so let's apply this on the above so we have x is equal to log of 7 add this so multiplication turns to addition so you have 10 divided by log of 7 squared keep solving so this is the same as x is equal to log of 7 use this to divide each numerator so you have log of 7 squared plus log of 10 divided by log of 7 squared. So what do you do? X is equal to log of 7 divided by, remember the power multiplies, so it gives us 2 log 7, add log of 10 divided by, this gives us 2 log 7. What did you observe? These two are the same. Remember the quotient of this is 1. So this gives us x is equal to, we are left with one half, plus log 10 divided by 2 log 7. Now we can still leave this this way because 10 is not yet simplified. We know that 10 is the same as 5 multiplied by 2. So we are going to affect this 10 with this. Let's do that together. So we now have x is equal to, one half plus log of five multiplied by two is divided by two log seven. 
keep simplifying x is equal to one half plus log of five remember your multiplication turns to addition so we have log two and all these are divided by two log seven keep solving so we now have x is equal to one half plus so we have log five we are going to use this to divide each so we have divided by two log seven plus log two divided by two log seven we keep simplifying now you, you notice that this cannot cancel out because they are not the same so just remember at this point for every log of a divided by log of b it's always log of a base b this is your change of base rule so if you apply it here we are going to have x is one half plus now remember the quotient of this log is one so we have one over two log of five now this becomes base seven plus this will give us one half log of two base seven and this gives us the simplified value of x you can also rewrite this as x is equal to one plus this is the same as log of five base seven plus this is the same as log of two base seven and everything is divided by two so you can also leave this value of x as this or they are both the same so either this or this is correct now at this point you are going to do a check to plot this value on the left side to see if it gives us 70 let's do that together to verify so we are going to have it this way so we are going to choose the left part this is what we have 7 to the power of x multiplied by this remember this gave us 7 to the power of 2x so we want to know if this will be equal to 70 when we plug this x value so remember we said these two are the same so we're going to use this you can also try this it gives the same result so let's do that so we are having 7 to the power of 2 our x is this so we have replace it 1 plus log 5 base 7 plus log 2 base 7 and is divided by 2 so what do you do you observe that this is 2 on 1 so these two cancels these two so we are left with 7 we are left with 1 plus log of 5 base 7 plus log of 2 base 7 remember this is the power of this 7 so what you do now is just quickly remember what you said before when you have this it is the same as a to the power of m multiplied by this so we are going to apply this here so from here we are going to now have 7 to the power of 1 addition turns to multiplication so we have 7 to the power of log 5 base 7 turn this to multiplication 7 to the power of log 2 base 7 and what do you do at this point just remember for every a to the power of log b base a these two bases are the same it gives you this number b so if you apply this logarithm rule on these ones you see that these two bases are the same so we are going to now have 7 to the power of 1 multiply we are going to have 5 multiply we are going to have 2 and 7 to the power of 1 you know is 7 so when you multiply 7 by 5 is 35 multiplies 2 gives us 70 so in conclusion we have it that the x value we got as 1 plus log 5 base 7 plus log 2 base 7 divided by 2 is absolutely correct and i hope you learned something if you did don't forget to give us a thumbs up share this so that they're going to send to more people if you're still new hit that subscription button and i also be curious to see your own method thank you for choosing to learn to us i will see you in my next class bye